right, thank you everyone for coming. Uh, let's get right to it. Uh, Denis Fistanić, Hajduk Split. Mike Prebanda, Hajduk Split. Adrian Svicic, Venkin Cranium. Salvatore Krakiolo, Palermo. Ljubo Grgić, Hajduk Split. Mate Folsomić, FC Chicago. Joško Prebanda, Hajduk Split. Members of the media, Mr. Svistić is now open for questioning. Your team went winless last year. What improvements have you made this year? Uh, well, this is a it's a brand new team compared to last year. Um, first and foremost, I dropped all the Dinamo Zagreb players. Uh, as you can see, I have four Hajduk, five Hajduk split players this year. Uh, it's a completely new team. Uh, I expect nothing but the best out of my Hajduk split players, and we're going for the championship this year. In the opening game uh, this year, you're going to be playing XMLS Saranjavadra. How do you plan on shutting him down? Well, last year uh, we had a defense comprised of uh, Dinamo Zagreb players, and this year we have we have two defenders from Hajduk Split, and it, it's really hard to shut him down. I mean, you know, the guy played MLS soccer. Um, we plan on having a couple guys on him. Uh, at all times, and just hope for the best. Uh, any other questions for Mr. Svistic? No, thank you. The interview has concluded. Ladies and gentlemen, the press conference has started. Good evening, everyone. Thank you for coming. Here's the final nine for the tournament this Saturday. Goalkeeper Shane Rossi from the Genoa Youth Academy. Matthew Lebo, Dinamo Zagreb. Sean Maricic from FC Dundalk, Ireland. Clyde Hancic from South Africa's Kaiser Chiefs. Nick Bilic from the San Jose Clash. Nick Govic from your Redondo Thunder, Matt Malkanovic from the Chelsea Youth Academy, Terry Matosic from Bolivia's Premier League Real Mamabor, and finally Ivan Matkovic from the San Jose Sharks. Those are your final nine. We'll be opening up questions to the floor. Nick Govic was a possible scratch uh, for this weekend. What is his condition, and uh, will he be ready for Saturday? Uh, Nick Govic did uh, pick up a small virus uh, this week. He, he did not train with the club. Um, however, uh, our trainers did say that he will be uh, at least 90% uh, available for the tournament on Saturday and, uh, and that he should be good to go. Uh, we're really counting on him. He's, uh, he was the, the top scorer uh, two years ago. So, But uh, he will be ready to go. He will be in the starting six. Adriatic Treble has won uh, the tournament three out of four years, Coach. Uh, what are your plans if you should meet them in the finals or any time in the tournament this year? Yeah, we didn't pick up Adriatic in, uh, in the group stage. They have won the tournament three out of the last four years. They're a strong team, and uh, they've been together, that core group of players together for a long time. Um, I like our chances. We picked up some good uh, international players in the off season, and, uh, and we're ready to go. So... Uh, Look for CroatianSports.com to uh, to take this tournament by, by storm this this year. All right, folks, uh, that's the end of questioning and uh, the end of this interview. Yeah, thank you.